in and around downtown Birmingham is soaring. Developers are not only building from the ground up, they're redeveloping structures that haven't been occupied for years. WVTM 13's Jeff Eliasoff says it's about to happen at the scene of a tragic fire in the Five Points area. On October 26, 2015, fire broke out on the second floor of the building Trades Towers on 10th Avenue South. I remember describing the scene as smoke filled the building and worried residents awaited rescue. A door-to-door -door search revealed 80 people, many frightened, some in night clothes, a baby, all in need of fresh air, fast. They were indeed rescued, but most were never allowed to return. The building considered too damaged to inhabit again. The towers have stood as an eyesore ever since. Now, six years later, a developer armed with federal historic tax credits is about to spend $40 million to gut and renovate this building first built in 1969 for senior citizens to make way for urban professionals sometime next spring. More than 200 studio and one-bedroom apartments will reawaken this 12-story landmark. For Mayor Randall Woodfin, renewal here says two things. One, there's an appetite for more people to be living in our city limits. Two, um, people need to be able to afford to stay in our city limits. And so a part of this deal is that it's affordable housing. So I think that's extremely important to acknowledge and something to celebrate. What was once home to retired building trades workers will soon be home to workers and students in a rebuilding city. In Birmingham, Jeff Eliasoff, WVTM 13.